According to a new study from National Taiwan University, people with 30 years of exposure to PM2.5 are 1.044 times more likely to get lung cancer than people who smoke a pack a day. The study looked at the north and the south, where air pollution is more severe. It found that in the south, the rate of increase in lung cancer, in lung adenocarcinoma, was over 10 times higher than the rate in the north. All signs indicate that air pollution is a greater risk factor for lung cancer than cigarette smoking. The study, conducted by NTU's Department of Public Health, looked at 143,000 lung cancer patients and their PM2.5 exposure in the 30 years before diagnosis. It found average concentrations ranging from 8 to 46 micrograms per cubic meter. For every 10 microgram increase, the cancer risk also increased. Government statistics corroborate the finding. In 2020, Penghu had the highest incidence of lung, bronchial and tracheal cancers at 66.89 cases per 100,000 people. High up on the list were other areas with heavy pollution, which ranged from 42 to 44 cases. Then came Shinju City with 41.68 and Ilan with 41.28, followed by Jilong, Taichung and Taipei. In recent years, due to the increase in air pollution and issues arising from new homes such as formaldehyde, there has been an increase increase in indoor levels of PM2.5 and PM10. This has raised the risk of lung cancer and some cardiovascular diseases. In 2022, PM2.5 levels were highest in Kaohsiung and Pingdong, followed by Yunling, Jiayi and Tainan, which averaged 17.1 micrograms per cubic meter. Central Taiwan came third with 13.8, and fourth was Shinju and Miaoli with 11.1. The North recorded 10.1. NTU's Department of Public Health said that due to heavy pollution in the lower half of the island, the government should ramp up public health education and lung cancer screenings. Researchers say that whether PM2.5 is from car exhaust or industrial activity, its health effects must be taken seriously.